laundering. Drop the shanks, ask for banks. Money laundering. If you're found in possession of a large amount of cash, whether it's in your vehicle, on your person, uh, at your address, and you can't account for it on the spot where that large amount of cash came from, you'll be arrested for the offence of money laundering. Uh, police will automatically assume that those funds are not legal funds and you obtain those funds through the proceeds of crime. I had a case a few days ago, there was like five, six individuals in a house just having a little drink up, it was a Saturday night. Um, police have um, been made aware that there may be some drug dealing from the house, so they've came to the address, they've had a warrant, they've searched the address, um, and they've found just under 400,000 pounds in cash in a wardrobe. To be fair, um, I think five of the six people didn't even live there, um, but they was arrested anyway. The one person who was the occupant, um, he never, he refused to comment. Um, everyone was arrested. So it's not just drugs or other prohibited items that you can be arrested for, cash. Believe me, sometimes they take raw cash more seriously than raw drugs. Because if you're money laundering, and your cash is from the proceeds of crime, that means King Charles ain't had his cut, you haven't paid your tax, and when the king ain't had his drink, you're getting nicked. Be safe, be legal.